All right, in this video, we're gonna go over the torture chamber. It's kind of a cool thing. If you've complete the Assassin's uh, Dark Brotherhood stuff, you can get a torture chamber. So let's check out the torture chamber. If you get this thing, it's uh, 5,000 gold from Devin Mallory, some guy in Riften. But as soon as he comes up and says, hey, do you want all this stuff for your hideout? You can have blah, 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 torture chamber, blah, 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 blah. I mean, obviously, what are you going to take? Torture chamber. When you get torture chamber, they add a new room to your uh, assassin's hideout here. With uh, torture victims. These guys. And, uh... I've told you everything I can. I don't know what else you can want. Yeah, they're kind of sad. They, uh, they'll give you a location on the map where you can go to get some gold. And you don't even have to torture them, you can just stand there. So watch, if we go and stand next to, uh... Go for this lady here. If you just stand here... Just let her, let her bask in our glory. Is it information you want? Oh, it's information, all right. Tell us. This is about the inheritance, isn't it? All right. Yes. I'll tell you where I've hidden it. The inheritance, please tell me where you've hidden it. Go on. Uh, Any time now. It's in a hollowed out tree stump in the marsh, uh, south of solitude. Now, please, you'll let me go now, right? <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, as you can see, the uh, thing pops. You get a quest log entry for the hidden treasure, and you can Why just go get it. Dear, and let me go now. But you can, uh, you know, they're torture victims. They were to anyone. So, you know, oh, you, can, uh, you can torture them a little bit. <laughs> you can cut them up. You can... Uh, you can do all kinds of stuff on them. What's kind of cool is you can heal them too. So if you go for like a healing spell here, you can slash them up a little bit, and then you know you can heal them. Well, you know I'm real sorry for cutting you up. There's some heals for it, and it's kind of fun. I don't know what happens if they die. I've killed them, and then they never seem to come back. So they may just be one-offs. Maybe they come back after a while. But you can definitely skill up on them. You can load up on like you know your one hand, two hand, and then you heal them, and then you just keep hitting them. And you can make them do funny stuff like have ice spikes in their heads, like if you get the angle just you, right. You can't do this to me. You try to put it so it's going like right through his head. See, remember if it's right-handed, it's going to be a little bit to the left and vice versa. So you can line up and try to like put a put an ice spike like right through her leg here. Scratch. Yeah, just a scratch, huh? So that's it for the torture chamber. Uh, I'm gonna go grab the treasure so you can see what it looks like. It's kind of cool. Uh, each treasure's, at least on, on master difficulty level, Do you need each treasure that I've found is like between 1,000 and 1,500 gold, which is actually pretty decent money. It's 5,000 to get the torture chamber, so maybe it pays itself off evenly. They all add up to 5,000, but you get the fun of... I'm sorry, it's not fun. You get, you get to... In terrorize the torture guys so yeah here it is under miscellaneous quest take the hidden treasure so if I set that uh, we'll see where it wants me to go take the hidden treasure it's somewhere outside Folgenther which I don't have but I got the company warehouse so I can go there and the treasure is always just in like a hidden rock or a tree or something you don't have to clear out a whole area to get to it you just run up and take it I'm hopeful that um, either the uh, the guys will respawn or they'll uh, have more treasure. So what I was going to do is I'll just kill a couple of them. Uh, that's not going to work. I'll just go on foot. I'll kill a couple of them and uh, see if they respawn with new treasure. So I'm going to go grab the treasure real quick and see what it's all about. And really, if you spend a lot of time torturing them, well, I don't know. You already completed the Dark Brotherhood quest. You're probably a pretty demented 
sick, twisted, evil person anyway, so might as well just torture him, right? Free skill ups. They do say some funny stuff when you beat on them for a while. So yeah, haul it out tree stump. 2,000 gold. Not too bad. You grab the 2,000 gold. That treasure uh, or torture chamber pays for itself pretty quick. And maybe they respawn. Even if they don't, it's still a profitable business venture. So I recommend you take it. Thanks for watching. Bye.